YouTube, it's me again, the Scoundrel M. Uh, we're going to play some more Hitman Blood Money because I feel like it. And we've got a new level, so why not? It's the Mississippi one with the crocodiles and stuff. I remember this one being quite good. Should we get cracking? Should we turn my face cam off? It's pretty dark, isn't it? Yeah, let's do it. Bye. Okay, now into the game and load the profile. Scoundrel M, away! Load successful, good. Let's start the game. We'll go for pro. We'll pop down here and we'll go for you better watch out. No, wait, no, this is the wrong one. No, no, cancel. Back, 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 back. Your next assignment's in the Rocky Mountains. Damn it, Senator I can't. Is being blackmailed by pornography tycoon Lorna Haviland, who has a compromising video of the senator's son, Chad. Damn, this is really annoying. How many missions have I completed so far? Uh, I couldn't tell you off the top of my head. We'll have to have a little look. We're going to be quitting back out in a second anyway, because I've clearly messed up. Uh, is I can upgrade the silver ball is in any way while we listen to Diana waffle on? The video could cost him the election. So could any future misbehaviour by his son. Not really. Other than dual wielding, which I find a little bit inaccurate. Got any more miscellaneous equipment? What's this? Extra mine. Got it equipped though, haven't we? Yeah. Never mind. Uh, how can any statement with the, the with the words "porn cup tycoons mountain estate" be so boring? Shut up, Diana, please. We have to get out of this. I'm not even going to play this mission. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll just go nuts at the opening. Seems like a sensible thing to do, right? Select weapons, silver wallace. Oh, I could have clicked start mission. Oh, the stupidity washes over me in waves. Right now. Oh, not as much as the stupidity of not bringing a fucking gun. Okay, here we go. Hold on a second, people. There we go. Oh, lovely. Let's try for another one. Fiber wire? Nope, that's the one. Oh, lovely, we're going to get a slow motion one as well, because I just set it off in time, didn't I? Come on! There it goes. It didn't get our assailants, but never mind. Never mind. Right, let's go and actually count how many missions we've done. Quit. There we go. <laughs> Finally. Okay, so we have done... One, two, three, four, five, six... Seven... Eight... You're kidding! I didn't... But I completed it last night. It would appear I have to play this one. Damn, we've got to do it again. I genuinely thought we'd done this one. Hmm. Right, let's go. This time. Maybe I should just get rid of the YouTube intro and uh, start again. Because that's an embarrassingly poor start, right? Nah, let's not bother. That would require some editing. <clears throat> I must have not saved at the end of last session. That is very, very annoying. Right, come on, let's not muck around. Let's get this lift going. I know what I'm doing here. I'm a seasoned professional. I've made it out of this map alive before, you know. Come on. This is going to be surgical, precise, calm, methodical. All the adjectives that make Hitman what it is. <clears throat> That's true, I was under some stress there. Here we go. Uh, not over there. We need to go here. Then we need to go into the old F1 view and whip out our... Let's not um, inject him with adrenaline. That would be stupid. Let's sedate the fool. Okay. Lady walking past. Does it make a difference if I sneak? Uh-oh. There's a guy watching. Turn away. Look somewhere else. Shoo. Shoo. Wander off. There he goes. He's off. Okay, this time. Okay, can I grab him? We got him. We got him. Get him in there. Oh, bollocks. I've been spotted. Ah. <sighs> No, oh. it never works out quite how you want it, does it? 
Oh, it's working out very badly for me, actually. There we go. Closer quarters is much easier to deal with. Damn, I'm doing very badly compared to last night. Uh, yesterday, actually, during the day rather than last night. Okay, the bodies are piling up in the doorway a bit too high now. Ah, the red dot goes away through the thingy. I don't like that. Okay. Well, every now and again, I, all the time, it goes completely wrong. Damn it. I put my gun away, haven't I? Yeah. One. Two. Missed. Wait for the red dot to settle. Ah, oh, damn it, scoundrel. One more hit, and... Oh, no, I'm done. I'm toast. You see, Super Chaser, I need to be watched. Otherwise, things go awry. If I'm not being closely observed and made to stick to strict rules, it just all goes pear-shaped. Maybe, maybe going for this guy's outfit is the wrong technique. Or maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe if I throw a coin through the waterfall, he'll come in... And I can just punch him. That's true. YouTube is always watching. I am in the YouTube panopticon. Or at least when I upload my videos I am. None of my uh, Hitman videos have been published yet at time of recording. I've been playing this for a few weeks now. And we're still working through the backlog of Darkest Dungeon and um, uh, Stardew Valley. How did I forget Stardew Valley? Yes, yes, yes. Good evening, sir. If I want special treatment, in air quotes, I need to go into the special area with my VIP badge. Okay. You are a very crude man, sir. This is not what I have come for. Okay, we're going to try a different technique. We're going to go for the coin. Hang on. Coin. And when I do that, I'm going to walk out here. Oh. I got spotted. No? Did the photographer run off to get a guard? Because I threw a coin. Come on. Is my whole plan going to be thrown off kilter by this? There we go, that's better. If I put the camera here, I can see through only one waterfall. Are you going to come back there? No, he's not. He's run off. We're already in sub land. Any guards coming? No. Nobody. Well, this is very difficult. Yeah, I'm, I'm still I'm still uh, enjoying Stardew Valley a bit there, Super Chaser. It's it's a nice game to just you can walk away from it and come back, and you don't have to have you don't have to remember anything. You can just pick it up and keep playing. Oh, here he comes, here he comes. Hello, Mr. Cameraman. He's just going to sit straight back down again, isn't he? Come on, guy. Maybe if I chuck the coin right here. No, nope, he just goes off, does he? Hang on. Oh, I no wonder he runs off. He sees me. Okay, okay. All right. I know what's going on here. This has all gone wrong, but we're going to restart. Don't worry. Let's just pop. finish this off with a little shooty toot. That's better. Who's over here? Anyone? He might pick a gun up. It's always possible. Uh oh. Okay, they don't seem to have dealt with me yet. No doubt more guards are on the way though. Oh, they're behind me. Oh, and they're in front of me as well. Okay, we restart this time. And this time we know what to do. We stay on the other side. 
You stay on the other side of both waterfalls. Throw the coin in. He comes in, looks at the coin, turns around, I sneak in. We sedate him and there's no chance of a guard seeing us. Okay? This is the doctrine. This is the plan. Let us follow it with precision. Uh, you do need to manage your time a bit, but you only need to do it so far in advance. As long as you look at your calendar and go, how long have I got? What can I plant? On any given day, you can make a decision, a correct decision about what to do, given the circumstances. You don't, I mean, you can't stick to a really long-term plan. It's just not viable. Let's get that coin out while I'm running. There we go. There we go again. Very, oh God, I panicked. Okay, so we've got our coin. G, throw the coin in. No, get the coin out. There we go. Throw the coin in. That's that. He comes in. We get out our sedative. Put it away quickly because no one's looking. Okay, he's come in. Sedative out. Turn around, photography. Turn around. We got him. Oh, so much simpler. So much simpler. Didn't have to wait for guards. We just did what we needed to do and got it over with. Okay. So, uh, thing two. Uh, let's go place the mine. Yeah, let's do that. We'll go upstairs, we'll place the mine. We'll come back downstairs and we'll see if we can place the mine on the um, on the uh, pool too. Because that would be handy. If you can put one on there. I don't know, did they detonate at the same time if you place two or just one at a time? Hmm. Difficult to say. Right. <laughs> elevator indeed, yes. The ever popular elevator. Um, it, I, he's very impressed, my son, with the uh, elevators in Portal and Portal 2. And as such, anything tangentially linked to them, such as real elevators, is something that he really, really is keen on mentioning. Actually, while this guy's trundling around over here, we can wander in here. Hey guys, how's it going? I'm just going to stand here looking at this cup. While you wander off over there, looking the other way and I get the tape okay so we have one of our objectives complete it's nearly all if I'm not streaming it's almost guaranteed to be my son playing on my Steam account <laughs> not me uh, I very rarely actually play oh, I only play it with him so every now and again if he's playing Portal I mean I've played enough Portal I've completed both games I've done it but I mean he every mod Every sort of reskin, he's all out for it. He loves it. Which is all cool. I mean, there aren't many games not well, games of that quality available for and suitable for kids his age. You know, a lot of games I just have to say to him, no, you can't play that, no, you can't play that. But Portal is a pretty good one. You have to be slightly mature enough to get some of the darker references, so it's all right. Or at least that's what I'm telling myself to justify it. Okay, bomb placed, good. So far, no alarms raised. Let's head down here. Get back down the ladder, but we'll check before we do that nobody's ogling us. Ah, oh, look, there's a guy there. Let's wait for the door to shut. Check behind us. I don't see anyone. Right, let's get down. Oh, that was a bad idea. But it's okay, we're not dead. Who, what the hell? Jeez, you made me jump, mate. Okay, so, take one. Now, the poison sausage thing doesn't seem to work that well. Uh, he's only five. The game's, one of his ga uh, mate, little kids at school reckons he's, ooh, reckons he's played Portal 3. So that's the level of discourse we're playing at. That's, <laughs> that's the kind of level of uh, sophistication of gaming. Like, utterly fictional. Oh wait, I can go down the the uh, stairs, can't I? And that gets us through the security room to get the tape. That's probably a better bet. So I don't think a lot of the kids are playing a huge amount of games. 
Oh, excuse me, Gardy. Okay. Although, who am I to say the kid hasn't played Portal 3? Maybe he's got some kind of time machine. Or, potentially, an alternate worlds device. I've got to lure you guys out of here somehow. I can't do it with both of you. But he is that playing with blocks. They just happen to be Minecraft blocks. Okay, we'll come back for that videotape later. For now, let's uh, head out here and see if we can see the pool. No, the pool is above us still. We need to go down to the staff floor to get to the pool, which will be down here. Into the kitchen, where we can poison the sausage. Provided Santa isn't watching. Oh, come on, Santa. Give me a break. We could, of course, sedate his out stuff, and then we could wander around as him, right? I don't know where he has access to, though. That's the question. Where does he have access to? Can we poison the food? No, no one eats. No one eats at a party like this. They're either... Uh, they've got filthy hands from awful deeds, or uh, they're too coked up to eat. Uh, well, I think, uh, well, my kids, I think, are quite <laughs> quite like me playing computer games. Uh, Kel, she's not fast. She plays some games with me. We have different tastes, obviously, but we do play some stuff. Our tastes combine, although I'm pretty sure I'd be lambasted for some of the stuff I'd enjoy playing with her. Um, and my parents, well, like, they, I don't think they get computer games at all. <laughs> I just don't think they, un uh, they, I think, but they do a bit. I mean, they did play back in the day when I was a kid. We had uh, like a Vic 20 and stuff, and they, I remember them playing briefly, but I don't think they ever. No, 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 no! Oh, twitchy thumb! <sighs> Buggeration. Let's just see if we can get the guy. Oh, no, no, it's not happening. Damn. Okay. I don't know. And as far as other relatives go, I think my nan might have a heart attack if she played some games. I think she would be so horrified by this one that I should be unable to speak. <laughs> but I think that's a generational thing, really. Rather than anything uh, to do with my nan in particular. But anyway, where are we going? Let's get up here. Come on. Bloody long ride, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, good evening. I've heard your spiel. Have you seen the film Edge of Tomorrow or Groundhog Day? Either of them will explain what is happening to me at the moment. Are we for real? What are you doing here? You do not have any place here. Don't put the fiber wire there. It counts as an accident, apparently, if you sedate somebody in the pool. So if I go in the pool like this, Wearing my suit. What are these guys? How are they going to react? Guards, does this not confound your sense of moral norms? Are you not going to join me down here and try and apprehend me? Damn it, we need to find a new way in. Just as we find the perfect way to get that poxy camera outfit, the whole schedule gets mixed up. Hmm. What to do? What to do? Hey, there's barely anyone looking from here. Look. If I go here... Oh, no, the girls can see. Mind you, if they die, there's no witnesses. Okay, we're going for it. Damn it, it didn't work! Beep, 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 Ah, oh, there we go, that's what we needed. Okay, nothing to do with me, sir. Don't know why anyone would think it was. 
We did only get our target as well, which is nice. Dead. <laughs> Dead. Dead. Oh, please, if I put a mine here and they all start bottlenecking, that would be fantastic. Good afternoon, base on Mars. That's very true. That's very true. Super chaser. Do we... Uh, everyone's on too high alert for me to sneak in right now. I can't believe we used a bomb and only got the target. That is pretty incredible. And I can't believe no one noticed either. So, uh, should we head inside again? It looks like the guards are all calming down. People are returning to schedule. Hmm. They drag the body down to the uh, security room on the very ground floor. And they stash it there for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, come on. You are not going to start guarding this corridor again. Oh, they are and all. It's all very exciting out here, isn't it? Right, so we can go in here. But I need to acquire some means of entry to the VIP only area. Then I can get the photographer's outfit. Then we can get upstairs and do our final uh, assault. Or do I want to get a guard outfit? Is there a good place I can get a guard outfit? Is there anyone in here? I'll try getting the Santa outfit. I'll see if he can get in there. Ah, oh, he's taken his bloody bottle. What a gittins. Where's the sedative? Got our sausage. We do need an outfit. That's absolutely certain. Oh, thank God he was looking the other way. <sighs> right, maybe that back entrance is now unguarded. Maybe they've changed their mind. And and this whole distraction allowed me to apparent somehow surgically detonate. He's still there. Surgically detonate my uh, secondary target and poison the sausage. He's gone in. He's gone in. So's the bikini girl. Okay, stand back. What on earth is all this traffic about? Everybody stay outside. That's it. Come on out. Come on out. Go around the corner. I head in. Right, then we wait for our moment. Is it all safe out here? Good. Seven... G, there we go. Get our uh, sedative out. Come on, mate, turn around. Turn around. There we go. Swooping for the kill. Oh, I fancy another coffee. I might go and put the kettle on in a sec. I won't uh, break con continuum for the game. It'll only take me a minute to get up and flick the switch. Right, uh, we should put the correct suit on first as well. And put this sedative syringe away. We don't need that. Okay, so far, so good. We've managed to surgically detonate our uh, target. And now we're entering into the second zone to attack our other target. His dad. Daddy target. Not Babby Target. Oh, Daddy Target, I killed your son with a bomb. More specifically, a mine, which is a particular type of explosive. Hey, dog. I don't want to uh, put too much pressure on you, but you are instrumental in my plan for executing your owner. And don't worry. Don't worry, I'm sure someone will look after you. You're a cute little puppy. Lots of people want to look after cute little puppies. Hey guy, how's it going? I'm just walking around. 
waiting for you to look in the other direction. You go through that door. That's it. You wander past me. What are you doing? Look over there. Look the other way. Don't be concerned by my presence. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Done. Problem solved. Get up here. Get up here quick. Don't get clocked. Let's get that bomb in place. Let's get that bomb in place. Okay, now once the bomb's in place, we want to place the sausage where the dog's going to go unconscious. I think the dog just falls unconscious in the same place regardless of where you put the sausage. Because when I put the sausage in the grave, it just ran over and... What's going on here? I haven't used both my minds, have I? Oh, no, there's the place the bomb thing. Silly man. Okie dokie. Drop that poison sausage for the dog. That's it, you go down there. What was that? Oh, ho, he didn't even see. He was oblivious. Okay, now, next stage. The sausage drop. And where do we drop the sausage? The G button lets us drop the sausage behind this lady. Oops, sorry. <laughs> She's not happy. She's probably seeing all sorts of symbolism that just wasn't intended there. You throwing a sausage at my ass? What does that mean? What does that mean? Well, um, it means I'm trying to sedate a dog, actually. No, no, don't take that the wrong way. I'm not calling you a dog. I'm not trying to sedate you. All I'm going to get from you by slapping your buttocks with a sausage is some kind of heightened state of negative arousal. It's not going to be some kind of... Uh, like calming thing is it how could why would i call you a dog stop it it's very good is this the optimal way of doing it i don't think it is i think i'm missing the trick somewhere here because at least a couple of times he's gone the dog's gone for the sausage the old man's gone to look at what's happened to the dog when it's fallen over i've set the detonator off and he's just bolted and got away with it there we go, doggy. Have your sausage. There we go. Come on. That's it. That's it. Go to sleep. The old man will... Oh, look at that. A bit distracted. No, 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 old man. Look at your dog. Look at your dog. Don't walk off. Oh, bloody hell. We're going to have to wait for him to come a whole cycle round again. And now we're definitely going to kill one of the other grieving people as they look at the poor stricken puppy. I suppose I could do it by uh, just shooting him. It would be quicker, but we do still have to acquire the uh, tape from the other room. Hmm. Come on, lady, this is unnecessary. Oh god, if they carry it off in a big body bag, that would be annoying. It's not dead though. I've just sedated it. Mind you, I have given a human dose of sedative to a small dog. Hmm. Actually, have I killed the dog? Oh dear. They do say that in entertainment you should never kill the dog. Shall I pretend to grieve? Oh, poor doggy! There we go, I had a grieve. Squeezed out some tears along with a little bit of... Uh, Something else? Yeah, God, I know. I know, it's a puppy. Well, it's not a puppy, it's a fully grown dog. This variety of dog remains small throughout its lifespan. Short lifespan, I should add. It probably didn't have much time left in it. Probably only another couple of months and it would have been dead anyway. The guards really don't care, though. They're like, oh, I wasn't paid to guard the dog. I'm only paid to guard the old man in the dressing gown. Who's not really that interested in his own dog. He just wandered off when it fell unconscious. Maybe I should push the detonator right in the tush slap. When he gives the lady a slap on the bum, he's locked in the animation and can't bolt. That might be the appropriate time. Where is he? Still in his little room. Probably sitting there, trapped in his cycle, waiting for his dog to come along. Hey, doggy, I want to feed you some chum. You want some? He's just sitting there, waiting for it to happen. He's on his balcony. He's probably snipeable when he's up there, isn't he? Let's go down a few floors. Where can I... 
Where could I possibly stand? Down here? All of these areas, it would be ludicrous to pull a sniper rifle out on. They've all guarded to the nines. Oh, he's on his way. He's on his way. Good. And they haven't taken the dog corpse away. <clears throat> uh, the unconscious dog. That's not necessarily a corpse. Got to remember that. Not necessarily a corpse. Oh, I probably shouldn't stand too close, to be honest. Oh, here comes the guard. I'm going to stand here looking all grim reapery. That's it. I'm just testing the lighting, mate. This is where I'm supposed to do my photo. Once we've done this, I am going to look up how you're supposed to do this. Because it feels like this grave setup must be some integral part of a certain type of kill. Here he goes. That's it. Bend over and... Oh, we got the target. Lovely. Sure, we took out a model at the same time. But, you know, sometimes collateral damage cannot be helped. Let's head out here. Right, we've only got one more thing to get. The security tape. And then we can collect our outfit and get out of here. Okay. We're all good. Doo -doo -doo. You all may as well go home, mate. Your boss is dead. You're not getting paid this month. Well, I don't know. I think his estate may be obligated to pay your salaries. I'm not sure, but you know, you really don't have any duties to deal with. Ooh, blimey. No, no. Oh, God, thank God it's the detonator. Uh, I can't go out that way. They get upset if I run out through there. Here we go. There's a heightened alert level. But that's look at that. They're still in the pool. There's the blood of where their host landed. Sub-host, not the father. Their host it didn't land anywhere. He just got crushed. Okay, I need to get to the security room. And I'm not entirely sure where that is now. I think it's on this floor. That's the bar. That's the kitchen. Now the security floor's a floor up. Damn it, I wish we weren't at a heightened uh, state of emergency because uh, it kind of makes it hard to see when people are freaking out about your presence. Damn it. I keep forgetting where the bloody thing is. Oh, there's the security room. Alright, guys. No! Uh, nobody saw me. That's amazing. Look the other way, Gov. That's it. Damn it. It was all going so bloody well. Uh oh, we've got to get three headshots or we're dead. Come on, come on. Reload, 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 reload. Open the door. Get that door open, you bastards. One. Two. Ah. No. All that work. Gone in an instant. Gone in an instant. I keep taking out the detonator because I keep twitching, to be honest. <laughs> My middle finger twitches occasionally and just clicks buttons when I don't want it to. Can I sneak around here to avoid getting seen by the camera? Alright, mate. Oh, shit! No need to get the tape anymore. We're done. This one's easy. We're good. We're good. No no trace on the camera. The guards might have thought it's slightly odd that I snuck behind them like that, but odd is not caught. Right, okay. Now, if everything's going our way, if it's an all-green-light journey to victory, what we're going to see here is no guard by this back door. No guard. No guard! We're good! We're good. We're rocking. We might even get a speedrun-worthy time. Seven... There it goes. We break out the sedative. Go into first person mode. Here we go. This is pro strats. What's happened? He's run away! Oh, he ran off. It had to go wrong, didn't it? Right, we're going to stand here and we're going to watch to see if he comes back. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> but we're going to try and stay out of sight. Where are you? Don't bring a guard wherever you are. 
Come on, photographer. Come on. Let your curiosity guide you to safe sleep. For you, this is literally the safest strategy you could employ right now. Or deploy, rather. If you come in here, get sedated and lay down face up in this shallow water, you're going to be fine and dandy. However, if you muck around and spot me, instead of sticking a thin little needle into your neck and pumping in a tiny bit of sedative, I'm going to be putting some high-velocity lead through your skull. And potentially, depending on how accurate I am with the first shot, through several other parts of your body. So don't risk the extra pain, and indeed death. Just take the easy survival option. Here we go. Is he coming all the way in? Nope, he's sitting down. Okay. This is the one. Come on in, sir. Now, turn around before someone comes into this corridor and bloody well sees me. You do, you get a message when the camera catches you. You see, like, a, that little green half-screen thing that keeps coming up when we go in there. Oh, shit! <sighs> okay, take two. Take two. Coin. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Turn around. Turn around. And go! Ah, oh, we've done it. Took a few full starts. And we've missed our perfect... <laughs> um, submittable uh, speedrun score. But... But we're doing okay. Yeah, he's got very poor eyesight not being able to see through that waterfall. Okay, right. Now, uh, the next place we need to go is the kitchen for a sausage. So we'll head out this way. I might let you take some special pictures of me. Oh my goodness, madam. Please, that's not what I'm here for. I'm on professional business. I can't engage in that kind of lewd conduct. Or did you mean landscapes of some kind? <gasps> no, no! Oh, I did it again! Ah, oh, damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Casual click just got me fucked. as well milk it while we're alive. Oh, well, not much milk there. Not much milk. Oh, how many times am I going to have to do this? What, dr put draw somewhere else? That's not the craziest idea anyone's ever said. But before I do that, I'm going to attempt just to do some, be disciplined about it. Let's turn the webcam on for a sec. There we go. Oh, simp a bit as well. Getting a dead leg. Oh, that's what I was going to do. I was going to attempt... Ah, ah! Not caught on the camera. Not caught on the camera. Too smart for you, guards. Too smart for you. Okay, where were we? Let's stop uh, lording ourselves and make sure that the item selected is not a visible one. There we go. No item. So if I accidentally draw something, we'll go into punchy-punchy mode. It's this guy again. Look at him. Did you get that smile through plastic surgery, or were you in a fight? Or, oh, that, actually, that could be both, couldn't it? Okay. Here we go. Pure, unfettered success and stealth. He's coming. Get ready. Ready to run. Ready to run. Holding down shift. Come on, turn around, mate. You're going to get stunned. I say stunned. Sedated. There's a difference, I'm sure. Boom! We got him. He didn't even have time to turn around and see what those squelchy footsteps were all about. Okay, now we make sure we're not selecting the syringe. And then when I right click. No, I still get the syringe. Okay, we're going to select that because that's not visible to uh, enemies. Okay. 
So we've got the photographer's suit, which means I can actually go this way, which will be quicker. Head out here to go to the kitchen to get the sausage. And then down to the servants level. Is it the servants level? That's the wrong thing to put it. Staff level, that would be the correct way to say it. Thankfully, Santa's not around, so we know we can whip our sedative out. Pop it away. Make sure we're carrying the fiber wire. Take the sausage. Take the sausage. Okay. Oops, wrong door again. And this one goes out here. Right, okay. Oh, I know, I know, I know. We got the kitchen out of this door here. I always forget that. Right, and we can go down to the staff floor. You see, I'm not sure how I can get the target to eat the sausage, that's the thing. A lot of the time you can poison food in these games, but I've yet to see any food being served. And who, does anyone in a strip bar really want to serve food? Is there a guard's uniform in here? Nope, there's a waiter's suit though. Don't need that though. Right, I'm hoping if I go out here, I can throw the mine, the sticky mine, onto the bottom of that pool. What do you reckon? Do you think it's going to be possible? It certainly might be from over there. Let's give it a go, see how far we can get over. Oh, bats, even though I knew they were there. You see, the, but I, I've never seen a way to go. I don't think the waiter's actually going to get a chance to go up there. But I tell you what, if this gambit doesn't work, this, if this current effort doesn't work, we'll try it again with that in mind. A non-detectable bomb. Okay, is that going to stick? Please stick. Ah, oh, you bastard. Can I even get that back? <laughs> Where's it gone? What's in here? I can't even remember what I'm doing over here. Oh, it's up to the brothel, isn't it? Yeah. Where the strange woman tries to assassinate me for some reason. <laughs> From that cutscene I accidentally skipped. Damn it, I was going to try and uh, stick a sticky bomb to that, but it, obviously not successful. Let's just shoot the thing out. Sure, we got some collateral damage to the tune of two strippers. However, we're all good. Actually, this is probably the worst time to be going that way, isn't it? There's going to be some guards coming out going, Hey, why are you sneaking across there? I'm not sure I'm allowed into the brothel area. We'll soon find out. They don't seem to give any shits. It's all good. Right, let's take our sedated sausage upstairs and hopefully we'll get our second target and the videotape. Okay. But you're right, if this fails, we'll go for the waiter's suit and we'll try poisoning the target. I'm just saying, I'm not 100% convinced that's going to work. Up, 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 up. Don't get spotted, don't get spotted, don't get spotted. He didn't get spotted, it's good. Right. We make our way carefully round here, we should be good. Oh, hang on a minute. Let's wait for him to do the tushy slap. <laughs> here we go. Have I been spotted?
No. Got no idea it was me. Okay, we better head into the security room then. Grab the security tape. It's alright, mate. Don't need to worry about me. I'm just a raging tea leaf. Ready to escape. Right, this is it. This is the time to be very careful. No more accidental clicking. Let's uh, make sure we select Fibroweer. Am I alright? I'm fine. I didn't even lose my poison sausage. I've still got my poison sausage. Maybe I should wave it around. Maybe not. Maybe I should keep that in my pocket. Keep that poison sausage in your pocket. And we're good. All we've got to do is sneak out without getting caught on the camera. And everything is tickety-boo. Excuse me. Thank you very much. Call the elevator. This could be it. This could be it. This could be it. I don't know why the music. I just... <laughs> just went a bit funny. Come on. Did I push that button? Seriously, what's going on here? Why is it taking so long for me to escape? Is this because of all the dead people? Honestly, that is nothing to do with me. Why would you think that's got anything to do with me? Oh, you don't think that's got anything to do with me, of course. Bye-bye. Guard? Oh, no guards. No guards. Oh, sorry, excuse me. And we are done. Look at that. Oh, finally. And it only took just under an hour. So what have we got? We've got seven accidental deaths, one shot fired. When did I shoot that? Hmm. I don't remember shooting my gun. Uh, and that's it. That's the whole lot. Oh, no, I shot at the pool, didn't I? That's right. Okay, so uh, continue. Lovely. Lovely. No notoriety. Oh, we got a silent assassin! Yay! We did it! We did it! I did it. Alright, let's continue. 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 Good. Silent assassin. Wanted by police. Show me more. Chad Bingham Jr. killed. Police suspect blood money is involved. The Rocky Mountains, 25th of December, 2004. Sacramento Police Department confirmed this morning that the youngest son of Senator Chad Bingham, Chad Bingham Jr., and founder of mail magazine Popcorn, Lorne de Havilland, were found dead in Havilland's luxury mansion last night. Investigators also report that a shot was fired, but it did not seem to hit anything. The police have stated that the lack of witnesses is making this an especially difficult case to investigate. The police have absolutely no clue of the killer's appearance as nobody claims to have seen him or her. Chad Jr. had become the black sheep of the family in recent years and local tabloids frequently ran unflattering photographs of the young man engaged in morally dubious behaviour. He was rapidly becoming a political liability for his father, whose sights have clearly been set on the White House for some time. Friends say it was actually admiration for his father that drove the young man to such excess. He wasn't like his old man. And he knew it, says one friend. He felt like a total disappointment. Whatever he did, so he just kind of gave up on things, you know. And I guess it was pretty inevitable he died young. Several Denver prostitutes have told the tabloids they were physically abused by Bingham. Unsubstantiated rumours of his involvement in the death of a popular stripper continue to circulate. His father dismissed it all as slander. The sad truth, the senator observed in a local television interview last month, is that when you run for high elected office, your whole family becomes fair game for these sleazeball journalists. It's disgusting. The whole family's pretty shaken up, says one aide to the senator. There aren't going to be any official statements or anything. The family just needs to get through this thing and hopes the press will let them grieve their loss privately. Crime Story, page 5. Donkey gets kickstart from off-season. Real football fans know that seasons are often won and lost before... <coughs> Who cares about sport? There we go. We saved it. We saved it. Thank goodness for that. And continue. Let's see what the game offers us now. Ah, January the 12th, 2005. A fine year. That's the year I met Kel. Welcome well, that was a fantastic cutscene. How useful was that? Gang known as the Gators 
handles the gators of drugs up and down the Mississippi. The gators move their merchandise on a tourist riverboat. Our client wants you to shut them down. Your job is to eliminate the six gator crew members and their boss. The client also wants any documents you find in the boss's safe, which is somewhere on the upper deck. The gators stay in their private area on the top two decks of the ship. Access to that area is limited. We have no other information. Keep up the good work, 47. Okay, I think we've improved our silver baller's accuracy, so that's good. Shall we start? I didn't really pay any attention to what Diana was saying, so do watch out. Skip Muldoon. He looks like a worrying figure, doesn't he? Okay, we start on the boat. I remember this much. And we've got this bit here. That's all cool. This is actually a totally different one from what I remember. This one is entirely set on a paddle boat. Oh man, the the, uh, the wedding might be the next one. Hmm. I still didn't put the PC part... Uh, right, okay, yeah, no, I've got to remember to do that. Although, I did uh, tweet it to you, if you want to check in your DMs. So, uh, you have it, just nobody else does. What am I doing? Why would I want to climb that? <laughs> That's stupid. Can we put bodies in here? Hmm, doesn't look like it. Hello, sailor. Let's head up into the ship proper. See what we can find. Oh, actually, let's check out here as well. Just anything going on down there? Just more lifeboat boats and an apparent dead end. Calm down, sir. Okay, that's the bridge. What about here? Let's look through this already open door. Ah, tantalizing. Oh no, so that's the interior of the ship. That's all good. It looks like I should be allowed in there. Should. Or am. That's the question. Seems like I'm allowed in here. Okay, so these must be people's rooms, right? Use key card. Okay, I've got to acquire a key card to get into the rooms. What is going to be the best outfit for access? I mean, you could look like one of these rootin' tootin' YMCA sailors. That's probably going to get you quite a bit of access. But what to? I wouldn't want to speculate. Staff only. So that'll certainly get you in there. We won't prat around in staff only areas wearing our suit for now. What's this? Huh. What you'd do out here, I'm not sure. But okay. I'll run around for a bit, see what's what. Oh, I'm not allowed up here. Okay. It's already gone wrong, so let's quickly uh, go to Ronsville. Anyone else? At least I know no one's coming from down here. Uh oh. Oh, what a time to reload. There we go. Probably don't want him right there, do we? Uh oh. Let's do some healing before we let this get out too out of hand. No! Ah. He got far too many shots off there. That's the sort of first level target, yeah. If we get any more than that, fantastic. But, uh, you know, think in that sort of ballpark. That sort of ballpark. Oh, because we're currently on like... It's coming up to 800. Come on, let's run out of guards. What, is the alarm going down? run around here. I should probably go into uh, first person mode for a second. No, it doesn't work as well. Hitman's meant to be third person. For sure. Whew. Oh, no, no, no! I put the gun away! <laughs> oh, perfect. Come here, sailor. Let's have a fight. I'm going to whack you one. Oh, well, he's devastated. Whatever I did, it looks like I just walked up and just gently tickled his abs. But okay, fair enough. He looks like the kind of guy who might appreciate that. Okay, skip Muldoon. 
You're my target. Off I go to succeed. Okay, let's not go up here. Let's try this upper floor. What have we got here? A dining room. What a delight. What an unalloyed delight. What special guests do we have? None of these guests. They're not special. They're just random faces. Food looks passable. Can we go through this door here? Hello. No, he's not trying to stop me. What have we got here? Oh, right, okay. Probably wouldn't be the dumb thing to stop people from going down here. So, oh, the kitchen. Probably get some kind of staff outfit there. Is anybody going to use the toilet? We're on a boat. Of course someone's going to use the toilet. Someone's going to feel ill. They're going to want to puke. And they'll run in there and go, Corpse! Corpse! So we'll leave that for now. Oh, what's up here? We'll be heading towards the uh, the bridge. Or is it just... Hang on a minute. Oh, here... Ah, ha, 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 ha. Okay, I was just thinking, what is the purpose of that corridor? And now I realise the purpose of that corridor is for access to this exterior. How lovely. Hello, Fuzzy Logic. How's it going? Okay, this is a dead end, though. Fine. I just need to find somewhere I can conveniently be rid of a guard once I've got their outfit. Oh shit, we're on a boat! We just chuck them over the edge! What was I thinking? Stupid me. Let's get down to a level where guards are actually walking along. At the edge. There we go. Run down here. Got any guards down here? There's one right there. So if I sedate him, I can then heave-ho him off the edge, right? That's how it works. What have we got down there? Nope. There's more deck. We can't do that. Right, we know we're not allowed to sneak around there. Let's try popping in here. It's just a regular corridor. Are we on the other side of the dining area? Oh no, this is the rooms area. Okay. What have we got going on here? This opens up into... Some kind of lounge? Okay, I've only remember this level thematically, really. I, I don't remember any of the details or the specifics. If anyone wants to look stuff up, feel free. Is this? Am I allowed up here? VIP, it says. I don't think I'm a VIP yet. Let's go in the toilets. See who wanders in here. Is anyone going to come in here and give me a chance to uh, take their clothes? No. Nobody there who I can rob of their outfit. Their vestments. What are you talking about? Do you mean me? You think I'm obnoxious? You don't know the half of it, mate. There's a lot of stuff about me that would curl your toes. Screw this. We're going to try it. We're going to see what we can do down here. Nobody's looking. Hello, sailors. Guns out, eh? Mm. I'm getting out of here. I'm not your buddy, though. Okay, this has already gone sour. I really should start shooting. But no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm going to find myself... What? Chumley? What are you talking about? Hello, Lazy Nostalgia. Oh, is this that one where there's like four or five different people you've got to kill and they're all in really heavily trafficked corridors? I think I remember clearing this entire boat out with a Spaz-12. I could be wrong. It might have been a different shotgun. But it was definitely a shotgun. Well, I can't clear steal her outfit. Whose outfit can I get? Let's go down to the lower level and walk around the side decks. This seems to be less populated. People want to be walking around on the upper decks for some reason. I don't know why. It's all good. I'll tell you what, if I did push him off the edge, is anybody down here actually going to give a rats? Or is he just going to drop down and nobody's going to come looking? You know what? I'm going to give it a go. Seems like a doable thing. Also, if I, whatever happens here when someone comes down, they're going to be a witness, right? 
Well, he's going to be a witness. Oh, he's wandered off. Huh. Let's see what happens when I do this. Ah, damn it. Pay more attention. Yes, I know. I appear to be a saboteur, but what you're misunderstanding here is I'm an experimentalist. I'm finding the possibility space and extracting the possibilities from that space. Okay. Damn it. <sighs> okay, let's restart and give it another go. See what we can do. Dun, 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 dun. In a minute, I'm getting a bit parched. I'm going to go make that coffee. I'm not going to stop the stream, but I'm going to have to apologise for the sound of a boiling kettle in the background, which hopefully will mask the sound of my quick dash to the toilet, because uh, that's also an issue now. That's also a thing. Okay, so you've got to watch out when you do that fuse box. So can I do the fuse box now? Anybody around? Anybody around? No. Okay, we're going to break the utility box. Keep looking. Keep looking. Good. Now, what happens when I do that? He comes down. Okay. Is there an open box anywhere I can uh, hide him in? Not that one. Go on, fix the box. Oh, the other one's coming to fix the box now. Look at that, the perrier. Oh, what on earth is this? Why have I done this on the M25 of ships? That's, for those of you not watching in the UK, a very busy motorway that goes around London. Possibly the busiest motorway in London, in England. Maybe not, though. Maybe not. I don't know. I'm not a traffic flow specialist. Except when I play City Skylines. Then I am. Get down. Get down! <sighs> that would have freaked him out. If he'd seen me standing on that box, he would have gone absolutely loopy. Fruit loopy. Can I? Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Listen, guys, as I've said, this is not the first time I've played this game. I've completed it before on Silent Assassin for every level. Just, it was a long time ago. So feel free to bust out those strats. Feel free to do the old spoilers, because uh, we're just, this is really just for funsies. But now that I've gone into it, I feel like I'm going to complete this. Then I'm either going to go back and do contracts... Or I might play through Absolution before I finally move on to the new Hitman when I get the new PC. Because I'm actually enjoying this. Much as I'm failing and failing hard consistently. You know. It's not that bad. You and your cigarettes. Now this area is too heavily trafficked. I bet I'm not even allowed up this step, am I? No, that's all staff only. That's it. Wander over that way. Wander off. Have I got time to kill him? No, I don't think I have. We need to find an unattended outfit. That's probably the better bet. Hinging my uh, my sartorial desires on the death of others is not a good idea, I think. Um, I think I am going to need a new PC case, to be honest. This one I've got, um, the side panel is all busted up and bent. Um, so, I think a replacement is best. And if I'm honest, although don't don't feel like you had to have to adhere to this uh, strategy or rubric for um, when you're putting forward a suggested build, um, I am I'm leaning towards investing more heavily in the processor, in the CPU, and then having a lighter GPU which I can upgrade at a later date. But then again, that's just that's just my thoughts. That's not yet any kind of concrete plan of action. Right? Is there anywhere on this damn boat where staff members stand on their own? Look at what they're making you wear. Why do you work here? Quit. Fucking, you'd be better off in a rubber dinghy than this boat. All right, okay. We know where we are now. The public area, this, the public areas of this boat are useless to me. What I need is a key card. So for that, I need to kill a staff member or gain access to a staff member's. Hello. Where are you going? Is this a dead end? Oh, shite. There has to be a bloody member of the public, doesn't there? Can we climb over the edge? No, we can't. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what constitutes enough. I mean, because obviously what I've got at the moment is enough. <laughs> I can stream with what I've got, which is written on the 
information underneath my uh, underneath my stream on the panel. So if you want to know what I'm streaming with, that's what I've got now. It's an i5 of some kind, but uh, I think the the 6700K is pretty high as well, a pretty good one, isn't it? It's the overclockable sort of mid to high range. I don't know. I, I need to look everything up before I actually commit to everything, but uh, having something to build around a suggested framework does uh, make sense. I'll take a look at that when I set the kettle off. When I get the kettle going, I'll have a quick look at the PC part picker link. And uh, picker link, that's a lovely little word, isn't it, that we've just stumbled across without even meaning to? Where's my picker link? I'd like to touch the pickle-ink and feel its lovely warm fur between my fingers. Or does a pickle-ink not have fur? Is a pickle-ink not even a creature? A pickle-ink might be some kind of small chain link made of picks. Or it could be ink squeezed from a pickle. I imagine that makes uh, a suitable source of invisible ink to some fantasy land that I've just invented in my head. What am I fucking talking about? Obviously, it's lemon juice. Lemon juice is the stuff that makes invisible ink. Hey, drunk guy. Is this your room? Should we, should we go in there? Come on, Picard. Give me your card. I'll swipe you in. Jesus, do you even know where you to sleep? Are you going to go stand somewhere on your own? Nobody's going to miss old stagger pants. Nobody. You see, the thing is, the uh, OBS needs a little bit of CPU power, uh, and it's an overhead. And also, I want to be playing games like Armour 3 and Dwarf Fortress, so, you know, pure processor power are, is useful in that arena. So I think I am going to actually, and plus I want to do Blender renders and stuff like that in my like, off time, so... I think I am going to get the mileage out of a uh, processor. And also, if you're going to upgrade a PC, the PC to upgrade is going to be the GPU, not the CPU. You don't want to end up sitting there get, having to replace the whole damn thing because your CPU is no good, or not up to snuff. It's going to be a, a reek pen and the bomb bomb. Okay, I've got to do something. I've got to get off the pot or shit. Let's try sneaking around this way again. May as well. That's it, jump across. And stop running and start sneaking. Uh, the the, the uh, CPU is easy to replace, but I would also like to point out that the GPU is easier because uh, you, you, uh, to get a new CPU, sometimes you'll need to get a new motherboard just for the housing socket. Like, I can't, you know, if I get a GPU, I can put in an AMD or an NVIDIA one should I wish to choose one or the other. But with a, uh, a CPU, you, you're sort of locked into one ecosystem. Of course, if you think I can get more bang for my buck, spending more on a GPU and getting a, an also-ran CPU, it's up to you. Uh, put that idea forward. I, I'm, I'm intrigued. I mean, this is the first PC I've built myself. I know a bit about specs for PCs, but this is the first one I'm actually going to have built for myself. There's no way I'm killing that guy without getting spotted, is there? Unless he wanders off somewhere. Are you going to do that, though? don't think he is. Nah, bruv, he's not doing it. I mean, I could try and ice him. I could just step out with the pistol and give him a shot to the head, but... I don't know. He's turning round. Go through that door. Okay, we're going to give it a crack. I'm going to try and sedate him. You did a trick about an hour ago. I want to be sedated. There we go. Let's get him over the first edge. Come on. Drag body. Throw over rail. Come on, mate. We've got to get rid of you. And we're good. That was a long drop, wasn't it? Okay, let's get over. Okay, everything changes. Where I'm hiding my uh, guns, I've got no idea. Although, it does look like I'm giving off a pretty big gun show. Hello, sellers. 
You're gonna have to search me. Come out here. Don't give them a chance to shoot their own guns to alert everybody else. That's the key. Come on, come on, come on, come on, reload, 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 there we go. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Was that one of the targets? Nice, I've got a target. Oh, another target. Ah, oh, the guys with the trucker caps are targets, okay. But at least I know they can only come from there or there, so we're all good. I want to reload, but I feel like now is a bad time. Ah, no, 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 don't do that. No, sir, I'm not interested in your uh, execution of me. Quite the opposite, in fact. My execution of you. I should really put my suit back on. There's no point wearing this ridiculous outfit. I'm a hitman. I'm not a village person. Oh, shit. That's it. <laughs> what the hell indeed, sir? Why didn't you shoot immediately? <gasps> uh oh. Oh, you. There we go. Got him. Okay, looks like we're going to have to get methodical here. Oh! Ho, 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 who's shooting me? Who's shooting? You are. Good. Okay, let's put some uh, heels in. Ah, oh, I've done it again. Made myself vulnerable to the people above me. Nobody coming? Okay. Okay, I've still got 83 bullets left. We're not doing too badly. Okay, go through to the private room. Oh, it's not a room. It's a private balcony. Okay. Oh, going through here. Damn it, civilians! Actually, I probably shouldn't waste bullets on these civilians. Even though they do pick guns up, and now I remember it. Holy shit, the girls do too! I thought it was just the blokes. Sorry, we're going to have to get rid of everybody. Just die. A private poker game. So this has definitely gone south. I get the feeling this is not going to uh, be a silent assassin ranking if we even survive to the end of it. Oh, another outfit. First class purser. That's that, that silly sock outfit. This has already gone too far south to worry about disguises anymore. Let's not even pretend. Damn it, chef. Can we poison this? Nope, not poisonable. Okay, we'll remember that for the next run. The inevitable next run. <laughs> because I'm dead. Bear in mind also, for this... Uh for this build... Oh, I am, I'm probably going to do a dual boot for Linux, thinking about it. But, but bear in mind... Um, but it's, uh, uh, what was I going to say? Shite. Uh, video processing CPU. Oh, yeah, I'm only going to be playing in 1080. So it's not like a 4K build or anything. Stand up. That's it. So maybe we don't need super duper power. Shit, let's 
Let's get out of here. Have I got any more medicine to take? Adrenaline boost quickly fills your body and gives you a short boost of health. Hmm. What is my health situation? Okay, it seems pretty bad. <gasps> no! Ah, damn it. Put the gun away. And we're doing so well as well. We were clearing that. We were making progress. Dear I do. Uh, no, I am. I'm going to buy the OS. Yeah, I'm going to dual boot with Linux and I'm probably going to buy uh, an OEM license because I'm building it by an OEM license for Windows 10 and see how that works out. Okay, guys, give me a couple of minutes. I'm just going to go AFK for a little while, make a cup of coffee and go to the loo and I should be back pretty damn quickly. Uh, bear with me. I'm just going to turn off the camera for a second camera i'm going to turn off the audio for a second and play some music for you back in the circ and youtubers see you in the next video bye like and subscribe